You're well aware of all the pressures that we're having just now across Scotland and across the whole of the UK with, with COVID and um, you know, with, with the winter looming. What we've been trying to do is use those pressures to drive some of the changes, to manage a lot of conditions that we would have traditionally brought people into hospital for an overnight stay for investigation, but to manage that on a day case basis where people can come in, have planned investigations, planned treatments and do that in a shorter period of time, which is more efficient. On a Thursday, I go to the GP who takes a blood sample and then that's sent off here and then they phone up and uh, to say whether or not I have to come in the next day. I don't think anybody ever likes to stay away at night, so uh, it's very convenient how this works out. And it, the doctors that are kept out of it, really, it's the nurses that do most of it. The last thing we want to do is keep patients in hospital any longer than they need to be. But a lot of the treatments and investigations we do here used to be done as an inpatient, now it can all be done as a day case and the patients can come in in the morning and go home in the afternoon. If we need to see them tomorrow, we will. If we need to see them in a month, we can do that too. It's forced us to look at how we do things. It's forced us to challenge the way that we, we've always done things and maybe be a bit more innovative. And I'm quite excited about the fact that that gives us opportunities to look that we will get the benefit of long after the pandemic comes to an end.